Are you a nursing student that wants to cut your study time by over 60%? Well, you can head over to simplenursing.com forward slash YouTube and sign up for free. Hi everybody, Dr. Mike here. In this video, we're gonna take a look at the conduction of the cardiac system. This is the electrical current that moves its way through the muscle of the heart, the myocardium, in order to tell it to contract. Now, the first thing you need to remember is that heart muscle is specialized. And when we look at it under a microscope, all the heart muscle cells are connected to one another like this. And they've got these little gaps between. Now, this is important because what you're gonna find is that these cells, like any excitable cell of the body, like neurons, for example, at rest, they have a negative charge associated with them. Interesting. And what happens is, if you want these muscle cells to contract, you need to turn that negative charge into a positive charge. And when it does so, it goes from negative to positive, it spreads that wave of charge change from one to the other very easily. We call this depolarization. Depolarization. This is when it goes from negative charge to a positive charge. And muscles won't contract unless this happens. So knowing this now, what we're going to do is we're going to have a look at the heart and have a look at how this depolarization event or negative to positive charge change happens through the heart to tell it to contract. It all begins here. This area at the atria is a specialized type of tissue that we call the sinoatrial node, also known as the SA node. Now, sino is referring to sinus. It sets what we call the sinus rhythm. This is the pacemaker of the heart, sets the rhythm about 60 to 100 beats per minute. Now, at rest, it's negatively charged, right? But what it does is it spontaneously goes positive, like I showed you before. And if it spontaneously goes positive, it's going to send a wave of positive charge throughout the muscle of the heart, specifically the muscle of the atria. Remember, two atria at the top, two ventricles down the bottom. This is the muscle associated with it. So, sinoatrial node muscle uh, tissue is negative. It then turns positive and sends a wave of positive charge through the atrial muscle in that manner. So it goes like this, spreads this positive charge through. Positive, 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 moving all the way through. Struggling to stay afloat during nursing school? Let me help you achieve our 96% pass rate by heading over to simplenursing.com forward slash YouTube and signing up for free.